Parents in the Canna McMillan School District fired up and apparently so are the school board members there. Tempers were turned up all over a face mask face off between parents and school leaders. Yeah, Heather, the heated exchange leaving the board to adjourn the meeting just minutes after it started. Brianna Smith joins us live this morning with exactly what happened. And Brianna, this certainly was a heated meeting. Yes, David and Heather, and it didn't last long because some parents refused to wear a mask. Instead, they swore at and insulted board members. Now, this all started when the school solicitor asked the audience to follow the statewide mask mandate and put on a mask. One man supported the solicitor and told board members to stop the meeting until everyone complied. But instead of and putting instead of putting on a mask, some parents argued with the school board. One parent says he feels like the board members have failed the district. And our we vote for the school board to uh, stand up for us, and they should stand up to the government. Should stand up to the mandate. If we're mandated to wear a mask. I think we should just do it and protect everybody. The meeting was adjourned and now it's set for September 23rd. In the meantime, all students, staff and teachers are required to wear masks. One Cannon McMillan senior says the majority of students followed the mandate yesterday, but students in other districts protested, saying masks should be optional. Dozens of students walked out of school yesterday, including those at Greater Latrobe and Hemfield. Now more students are expected to protest again today, and they hope that the school district leaders will eventually give them the choice to wear a mask or not. Reporting live this morning, Brianna Smith, KDKA News.